I have a Vizio Smart TV here. I'm going to show you how to set it up from the very beginning. All right. So first thing is go ahead and choose your language. I'm going to go with English. We want to go with home use. Click on OK on the remote. Where is your Vizio TV located? I'm here in the USA, so I'm going to click on USA. Choose your Wi-Fi. You can connect now. You can always do it later. We're going to go ahead and do it now. This way we get the uh, update right away as well. So I'm going to connect to my home Wi-Fi network right there. And then I'm going to go ahead and enter the password. After you put in your password, you want to go down to Next. So highlight Next. Click on OK on the remote. It's connecting to my Wi-Fi now. This could take a couple of minutes. Connection is successful. Let's make sure your TV is up to date. All right, looks like I have an update. So it's downloading now automatically. Your TV will restart automatically. This uh, update will take a few minutes. Still downloading the, the uh, still downloading the updates. You can see the progress bar right here. So we're just waiting, and then the TV will uh, restart. All right, the update is now done. Now it's about to restart. It's just sitting on this window now. Now I'm just waiting patiently for it to restart. All right, so after sitting on that screen literally for like three minutes, now it's finally starting to restart. All right, finally boot it back up. Let's make sure your TV is up to date. Now it's actually a download it. Now it's installing. This could take up to 10 minutes. So we're gonna wait patiently again. Oops, sorry. It looks like it's continuing more uh, downloading updates here. All right, now which room is your Vizio TV located? Go ahead and pick wherever it's at. I'm gonna go with bedroom right here. Click on OK on the remote. Your TV has been named to Bedroom TV. Let's set up your local channels. You can go ahead and search for local uh, broadcasting channels. Uh, you also want to make sure that your um, make sure the cable from the antenna wall or cable box is probably connected to the TV first. Okay, I'm not going to be using any of this, so I'm just going to go ahead with skip. You can always skip it and do it later as well. And I'm just going to go ahead and skip this. Terms and conditions. Uh, you can go ahead and skip for now, or you can accept it all right now. I'm just going to go ahead and accept it all right now. Viewing data, you may want to look through this, okay? You can go ahead and decline or accept. If you decline, I don't think you can proceed, okay? Anyway, I'm just going to go with accept here. You can go ahead and register uh, this Vizio TV, uh, get VIP access to exclusive deals and offers and so on by putting your email in. If you want to do it, go ahead. Or you can skip it and do it later. For me, I'm going to skip it and I'm probably never going to do this. So I'm going to just go, to go down to skip. All right, looks like it just uh, restarted again. Okay, uh, welcome to Smart Class, Smartcast. Just go ahead and you can click on continue right there. Uh, data activity terms and conditions. I'm going to go ahead and accept it right here. Oops. Make sure it's highlighted. And this is just some of the tutorials, how to use the input, change HDMI, and so on. So and now this pops up, now available on your SmartCast TV. You can go ahead and read through all this. Just keep pressing right. Quick start, AMC. And that should be it. Okay, you guys are up and running. Well, that setup really took a long time. This setup probably took, uh, this Vizio TV was the longest setup I've done on any other TV ever. But anyways, there you go, okay? On this one here, you even got AirPlay in here as well, and you can cast too. So pretty simple. Questions, issues, just comment below. Good luck, guys.